if i have failed low fertilization of totally fertilization failure next technique is icsi in the icsi is a intracytoplasmic sperm injection in this technique we are retrieving spermatozoa from the testes and isolate the spermatozoa and for this icsi we needed a inverted microscope with micro manipulator we have a integra 3 ri machine this is very high modified machine in this is we have a heating stage and embryologist is setting the first uh, holding pipette and injection pipette first we embolize the spermatozoa by with the help of uh, injection pipette and after in selecting the good morphological sperm then sperm, uh, embryologist is doing under microscope is sperm injection one sperm into the one oocyte after injection we culture our zygote in the triple gas incubator and we observe the pro nuclei fertilization check in after 16 to 18 hour of injection fitting the holding pipette alignment align the first holding pipette then i taking the injection pipette like this remove the injection pipette take out the holder loose the cap and fit very easily I am using 35 degree angle injection pipette and holding pipette. Lower down the needle, and you can see in the screen this machine is aligned. This this is at 4x. Now I am going to 10x. Little bit mag magnify. When we can see in the screen, TV screen, one side is holding and other side is injection at 20x. Now my machine is aligned, and then I little bit up the holding and injection pipette. and i am loading the oose sperm first and first i focusing the empty pvp drop and lowering the injection pipette and you can see this needle is aligned properly remove the Air bubble and take inside little bit PVP. Now next step is to move the your injection pipette towards spermatozoa drop and embolize the spermatozoa very easily. After embolization of spermatozoa, we will go to the oocyte drop and pick the single oocyte and inject it. by the first focus the oocyte and then focus the oulema and hold the oocyte with the help of holding pipette by lowering down and focus the oulema and injection pipette and by negative pressure just suck the cytoplasm and release the spermatozoa into the cytoplasm this is technique is called icsi icsi mean intracytoplasmic sperm injection this technique is very useful in low count patient repeated ivf failure or azoospermic patient
This is a day three compact embryo. This is good embryo. Compacting at day three stage is eight cell. Then rest stage is as per the IVF. Second day observation two to four cell. Day three six to eight cell embryos. Day five blastocysts. We have a witness program additional. Assistant embryologist is each and every step of embryologist observe and witness patient name, husband name, and each step oocyte collection, sperm collection. We are witnessing to each other and record it and sign the paper. In the IVF OT, we need first operation theatre table, or operation theatre light, and important is instrument is for IVF OT is suction pump. This suction pump will create a negative pressure, and clinician is aspirate the follicle from the female, and we need for tube warming to keep the tube at 37 degree centigrade, anesthesia machine, suction pump, and boil. Operators and one we have here is called arrow for air purification. This is the state of art whole side ovum pickup room and embryo transfer room. Strike.